तेरी मेर दा बोलना तुझे आगे अरदास गुरु गुरु वाहे गुरु गुरु आद गुरे नमे जुगाद गुरे नमे सत गुरे नमे श्री गुरु वाहे गुरु जी का खालसा progress and progression of life in the natural system life is taken place with the breath called prana through the strength of the pavan guru at a certain longitude and a latitude you have the reason for whole life to discuss why you were born at a certain longitude and latitude on the planet earth but this is a fact that you are born and then the life on his orbit starts going plus it on the axel of his daily routine through the day and night divs raat do dai daya khile sagal jagat it goes on progression is a statement of facts which normally people do not understand progress is automatic it can be negative progress or it can be positive progress dear guru says sakat sang na kijiye duro paiye bhag if there is a unholy congregation or unholy person there is no need of just confrontation or meeting or being there is better to avoid the situation because if you want to walk through the dirt you cannot come out clean then you have to clean yourself but if dirt comes to you or come in your way to get clean then it's your responsibility to do the seva to the service but the only way you can meet somebody is to serve it means to elevate that person there's no need to participate with that person the word progression is consistency of layer level of human life each day i was born i was a crawling child next day i was a walking child next day i was no no child then i was yes yes child then i was school child then i was college child then i was girlfriend and boyfriend child then i was a man child then i was a married child then i had children as a child this child progressionally went through many values but child remained as the basic essence all is the layer progression on that child now those you are you are children inside and you keep your dreams hidden and all you want to work hard and be rich and successful and then lay the dreams on the children that they have to carry your legacy and you end up saying i want to control my children i want to shape up my children i want to have my children do you understand that children have their own life they have their own destiny they have their have their own path of progression and progression and if they have chosen you as a parent it does not mean they are your slave they have cho- choose you as a parents that you have to pay the rent you have to share with them your basic belief your strength if you don't have any strength you have nothing to share if you care to share something share your character if you care to share idiot share your commitment if you care to share share your technique and ecstasy 
and strength through which your child can tomorrow be the strongest. Don't make them a bat ball of your emotions. You are cruel. These children have to be tomorrow men and women by their own right. You are ruining that right today. Because you are ruined yours. I asked a mother that day, how's your daughter doing? Doing fine. I mean, how much find? I just twisted the English. What is fine? You put your head in the sand and you like hostage and you say everything is fine. You think the world doesn't know there's nothing fine there? If you are failing as parents, you can learn to succeed. You can learn to earn the strength to be parents. It is the biggest service that parents serve their children to become beautiful, bountiful and blissful people, people of strength, peace and quality and tranquility. Don Dio iniko balewa. To give them something to somebody, give to your own children the values, strength. You don't give them strength. You give them hope. You give them cover. You give them your emotions and your feeling. You tell them everything is going to be wonderful and fine. And when the world is going to be faced, they are going to face the world. They are not prepared to face the world. They will be your first enemy. Take granted from me. I can sign it. Your children will be a first sore enemy of yours because you betrayed them. You lied to them. You lied to them so much that they cannot even understand you thereafter. They will have no power to hear you. They will have no power to put their eyes into your eyes. They will say, go and be dead. You will hear this sound again and again and again because you betrayed them, you didn't give them strength to face the world. You kept them in a lala land. You told them everything is going to be fine. You told them you are the wisest and you are the best and you are the most stupid on the world. Your stupidity they are going to find up, they are going to lock it in and that is what the science of progression means. Person gets awakened by the natural circumstances and environments and rational mind and the argument of the reason finds the truth. When there's no goodness in your heart, but there is goodness in your heart, but you are blinded by your emotions. You are a control freak. Once in my life I experienced, I went to house of a woman and she has the only child. Within my three minutes, I cannot forget that image right now. John, shut up the, shut up. John, sh sh close the door. John, get out from here. Fourth minute I said, John, come with me. We'll sit in the yard and sit and talk. I actually went to see her and I saw, saw that tyrant and I saw that cruelty on that little innocent angel, John. I took John out. I lie down on the ground. He says, Yogi Ji, Yogi Ji, I'll, I'll bring you something. I said, I don't need anything. I lie down on the grass with him and sat down. I said, hi boy, how are you? He says, fine. I said, your mom is telling you shut up and shut down and all that. She said, I don't hear it. Did you hear it? I said, I heard. She said, here it goes every minute. Later on when we were very enjoying and relaxed and she brought some food and everything. She wanted to come in. I said, no, we are very fine outside. Actually, I want to see John and I like to play. He's a very good boy. She was so jealous. She said, John, don't you know that you have to go to your friends today? You were telling me. I said, John is not going here. I hear his phone, his friend here. So don't push him out. John is going to stay with me and I want to stay with him. You want to join us? 
कम ही है हाउ पिटी इट इज दट यू क्रिएट योर ओन बॉर्न एज क्रूअल एज यू कैन बिकॉज यू लाइट टू दैम यू टेल दैम यू नो एवरी थिंग दस ए बुलंडर यू शुड टेल दैम दिस इज वट गुरु सेज दिस इज वट वी हैव लर्न दिस इज वट यू हैव टू लर्न दे विल नेवर बी योर एनिमीज यू नो बेटर यू नो नथिंग you want to be rich and you want them to be rich they want to find life they want to find experience actually the coziness and the love you give them as parents under the protection of that coziness and that love they want to find life they find they want to find fulfillment instead of they having fulfillment you give them direction you want out of your children grades fine spiritual grade moral grade social grade ethical grade manners grade specialty grade art grades is that school grades is the only grades you know because you want to hide your skin because you are unable to pay any attention to them you are unable to raise them properly what about your family grade how you how nicely you live as a husband and wife guru says ek jo do murti tan par pe ye so hai one soul and two bodies you fight like uh, rooster and rooster and you are create a scene we don't have to go to southeast asia to see this you can see in every home you have claws of iron you dig into each other's skin you play at each other's commotions And what happens children freak out there's no refuge home of the sick is the refuge of the god home of the sick where har prevails is har mandir where everybody can get refuge not you and look at the beautiful thing you have your own children have no refuge in your own home they are looking for friendship outside because you are not their friends even you are their executioner and you are their cruel judges as jury and executive together and you punish them day in and day out so what they do they run out and they find friends who just console them and ruin them from this torturous confronting death at home where there's no peace absolutely war going on all the time they prefer a slow death and you throw them to drugs to all those unfortunate things you think you are not responsible you don't love them because you do not know the guru's words and don't you know the bible in the beginning there was a word word was with god and word was god do you not guru nanak said akri naam akri sala akri gyan geet gun ga akhri likhan bolan ban akhra sir sanjo wo khan jinne likhe te sunaye jo farmaye te vindo paaye don't you read it every day is that one spoken word if you go to a child as six and said i am a disciple too and i have learned from sri guru granth this 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 and you should learn it too you will never have a conflict when you do not teach the child 
then child has no security. Then to create this security, you know what child does? He wants to grab Maya. Maya, poor fellow, cannot grab. He ends up with Chaya. He ends up into the fantasy of Maya. And such children are ruined every day. Yesterday, there was a meeting on how to create environments and how to save children and what spirit can do. I saw those children all over the countries and our whole country, all states coming in, eager to know how they can save themselves. Children want happiness. Children want success. There are two things children want. Children want security. If there is a surety on the house that there is a security, by demonstration, if father is a saint and a soldier, mother is divine and graceful, child will never ever go wrong. You may not speak one word. You give your children insecurity, you make them trash, you put them out, and you look the time, space, dogs, and the birds of time and space, tear them apart, and then you say, why well, can't do anything? You can do a lot. You gave them the birth by the natural law. You nurture them by the Guru's law. They'll be grateful to you. How many parents have taught that a child takes a cold shower is a fun. And if a child sits in a hot tub and takes a cold shower on the head alone, it's an experience of ecstasy which nothing can be equal to it. How many of you have done it? Have you sometimes did that? Sit in a hot tub, enjoy, relax, and then put a cold shower on the top of your head, on the crown of your head. And when you cannot bear it, mix the heart with it. Just see the fun of it. You don't need any experience. Is there self enough? Have you seen that in the morning when the first cold showers hit your body and the word Vaheguru comes out of you, you cannot reproduce it? How many of you have taken a bath with your own children and showed them what a shinan is? How many of you have sat down with children and read Japji line by line and translated it? How many of you have told your children what life is all about? How many children learn from you, my parents, that Ang Sang Vai Guru means what? Nam Chityave means what? Chardi Kala means what? Deg Teg Fateh means what? Children are taught nothing. They are taught those games. I went to the house of a Sikh parents and I had to go to a bathroom. So the main bathroom was busy, so I took the side room and side room was the child room. You won't believe in that side room there was every game of violence and every game of these funny cartoon guys, name them. From car racing to pilot flying and to all this, one third of the room was full with those games. Now what you are teaching your children? War, violence, Tragedy, A eating B, B eating C, C eating D, D eating E, that kind of game. You are teaching your children speed up to the point and go over. I, I watch in a couple of minutes because somebody was in bathroom. I say, well, this child is as far as I'm concerned dead. He's done with 
provided by parents. How many fathers and mothers ask their child, give me a massage, I'm tired, I've worked all day, I need your help. Your little hands are the angelic hand, they can heal me. You most cruel, inhuman, blind parents, you don't give them trust, encouragement, elevation, you do not give them any sublimation, and then you blame? You blame your children are wrong? You and children are not wrong, you are the worst. And then children know, you play the games, and then they play games. Then it becomes one game, one entanglement with the other entanglement, entanglement, continue entanglement, and this lofty, untruthfulness kills both. You die as frustrated parent, they live on with the legacy of frustrated children. This is not what Sikh Dharma Guru Nanak taught. This is not what Guru Gobind Singh taught. Guru Gobind Singh had four sons, two got break alive and two fought right in the field like heroes. And within the teenage you see there, we cannot speak the language of teenage. You mean Guru Gobind Singh, children were 82 year old and 97 year old? Huh? They were not teenagers? Where are you coming from? You have no mind of your own. You live in the past of the past of the past of the guilt of the guilt and you lay the guilt on and on and on and on. I was shocked yesterday those school little children were taking so quick notes that they may not miss even one word. They wanted to learn. That peace within can bring peace in the entire environment. And there was one beautiful lady, God bless her, she was wonderful. And she was a very professional preacher. And she said, I take the energy, all this energy outside, inside. When my turn came, I said, if there's no energy inside, the person is God dead. If there's no intelligence inside, person is called foolish. If there's no computerized progression in a person, person is called dumb. Inside, there's a human brain which God has given us to compute everything beyond time and space. And every child has to develop. And it's a simple line, Kalasan to touch out. God sat in a pasture and enjoy the joy of the creation. So the creature has to learn to sit in a posture, calm, quiet, peaceful, meditative, within the self, so that he can understand the universe around. Do you go to movies and jump around? First thing they told you, silence. First thing they put it on the screen is silence. How many times in life you have to observe silence? Never. Your children are very unfortunate. You have doors, but your cats and dogs are fine. They have their own door to run out in case your vibrations are no good. Somebody called me that day, oh, my cat has run away. I said, you must be disturbed from last 15 days. She said, how you know? I said, that's the maximum from a one moon to one moon, cat can take it. And beyond that, cat leaves. Because cat has a very sensitive nature. 
But if in the disturbances house continues, you should try one day. Have a disturbed house for 15 days, your cat will leave. And dog will never raise his head. You do not know what a monster you are and then you give the children those monster movies. There are two monsters in the house, mama monster and papa monster. <laughs> Plus you bring outside from the video shake, whatever that place they call it, monster movies. Plus television, this tube is giving too full of monsterism to people and extending the imagination beyond anything. And then coming to the Gurdwara is a pain in the neck. Who should get ready and dress up and come there? Sangat sang mukh ujjal hod. In the company of the congregation, brightness, beautiful bountiness comes to you. Saad ki sangat Sada Narali is excellent. This life, God has blessed you, Guru is guiding you, and your children need it. I know your surrounding is full of guilt, especially Judo Christian guilt. You will burn in the living hell here. There's no hell hereafter. Kala kalitar vasse, kadeon paani nasse. In the house there is a constant fight and indifference and clash. Even water leaves that house. It evaporates itself. The bickering, the nagging, the negligent, and all those bad habits create a lot of conflict and heat in which the cruel victim is the children. Today it has become a national slogan, save the children. Today it has become a national slogan, save the homes. Domestic violence is so bad you can't believe it. Children are suffering, you can't understand it. Life is so miserable, you have absolutely no sensitivity to it. And you are the cause of it. And you are the effect of it. Relax. Relax. Listen to the word of the Guru. You don't have to go to find Guru somewhere. Sri Guru Granth is with you. You do not read Gurmukhi. You can read Makalav. It's all there. You have to educate yourself. Your reliance is on the wrong angles of life. BJ Bik, Manga Yamrat, Vik Hoe Nyao. You sow poison, you expect nectar, look at the justice. That's what Guru said. Naam ki bela, pepe soya, mande kam note koya. When the time to chant the name of the God and be oneself and unisonness, then you sleep as snow. If there is any bad company voice, you get up faster. Karma kamam deya, tera koi na beli ram. O man of action and reaction, you don't have any friend. Karmi apo apani, ke nede ke dur. Your action will decide if God is in you or without you. Guru 
गुरु सतगुरु का जो सिख खाए पल के उठ हर नाम ते आए वन हु कॉल्स हिमसेल्फ द सिख ऑफ द ट्रू गुरु ही शुड गेट अप इन द रोशल आवर एंड मेडिटेट टू कॉल कार्य स्नान सिमर पर अब अपना मान तन पाए रोगा दी ब्रश लावर टेक दी शावर टू दी स्नान एंड सिट डाउन एंड मेडिटेट ऑन योर गॉड ओन गॉड व्हाटएवर योर गॉड इज गॉड विद अ स्पेशल टेल सिक्स हैंड नाइन आईज आई डोंट केयर व्हाट यू टॉक अबाउट इट एवरीथिंग इज गॉड सिमर पर अब अपना मान तन माइंड एंड बॉडी विल बिकम डिजीज फ्री जे नाम त्याई है मेरी जिंदड़ी है ता सुख पाइए ओ माय लाइफ इफ वी मेडिटेट ऑन गॉड व्हाई वी मेडिटेट ऑन गॉड गॉड गिव्स अस द वेट गॉड इज नथिंग अस बट आवर टोटल वेट गॉड गिव्स अस द डेप्थ गॉड गिव्स अस द हाइट एंड गॉड हैज गिवन अस वन थिंग लाइफ द कारवान ऑफ लाइफ विदाउट डेप्थ without width without height is shallow not accepting the ownership of god and not making your children to accept the ownership of god and to enforce the ownership of your own ownership is a direct corruption child has been given to you as a gift of god it should be offered to the kingdom of god the creation janni jane ta bhagat jan jan da ta ja sur nahi ta janni banj rahe kae gwae nu if she has to give birth she gives the birth to data the giver art the bhagata the devotee art the hero otherwise she should remain without a child it's not necessary that you should have nine more criminal added to the story list of the state and wanted by the police everywhere it is not so essential a act of grace to give birth to children and create more criminals it is no use a having a married life and having a frustrated home we have to understand that if we do not have peace and tranquility inside us outside entire creative peace and tranquility is no good for us that is why in sri guru granth guru talks to the mind mind is a wonderful servant but when it become a master there is nothing more rotten than that and when i hear some of you saying i cannot understand my mind doesn't go along with it i don't understand either what mind is are you are you are your mind is you i called somebody few days ago and i wanted to talk to the older child the mother said he is sleeping i said what are you doing i am awake i said what you have done i have taken a bath i said what are you going to do i am going to do sri guru granth and i am going to meditate i said why he is sleeping he is a child 
I say, when I was in the academy, my instructor never said, he's a recruit, he can sleep. If I was one minute late, not only I have to jump from the bed, I have to jump so high that I can touch the roof. I said, go and wake him up. You are going to the Guru, his useless mother, if tomorrow nobody has to understand to go to the Guru. If you are going to the Guru at the Imro Shalavar and you think you are holy, you are absolutely dark. If tomorrow your children do not learn and understand, go to the Guru, you are going to the Guru, it's just birtha. It's, it's useless. You allow your children to do your subconscious corrupt fantasies and you blame them. You allow your children to rot and be destroyed because that is what the animal in you is, that beast in you, and you blame children for it. You never gave them courage, you never gave them hope, you never gave them company, you never gave them strength to be with you the discipline you are in. They are already out. So it is our left is a matter of time. Yesterday, a mother was pleading for the daughter. You should have seen my face. I never had taken that many vitamins B6 to get that much red in my face as I got it. And I say, you, you interfere with my granddaughter. I shall wring your neck out of my sight. It's between me and my granddaughter. I don't need higher attorneys, useless and fat. And I can't afford to ruin the future of everybody. I try to reach out where I can. And this useless mother telling me that my daughter which is my granddaughter. Try to understand this now. My daughter is innocent. It's my granddaughter too. And I have never even called. Already the campaign has started. Can you believe? If it's so innocent, what's wrong? I have not called. I have not said a word. I didn't want to interfere. And what is so big in Sikhism that you can't follow, which is not in the Western world, early to bed, early to rise, makes a man healthy, wealthy, and wise? What is in Sikhism you can't understand? So yes, you sow, so shall you reap. If you are not so good, you will be a creep. And rest of the life, you are going to weep. What is that what Guru Nanak said separate than this? Karmi apu apni ke nede ke dood. Jinni naam te aya gaya musakat kaal. Nanak roj, every day you read it, every day you understand it. You don't want to understand it in English? Parents who drag their children with their commotions, leave them no choice but to put them to drugs. You are the main source of the destruction, fundamental and basic inferiority of your children because you never taught them Raj Yoga. You never taught them the loftiness. You never taught them the excellence. You didn't share with them the experience. It is your neglect and the guilt of that neglect. You are doing things for them. And you are poisoning them and blinding them 
with your own commotion and your own guilt and own insecurity and then you blame them. Taramdi Kirtakar, that's the sick way of life. Work through the sweat of your brow and whatever you do, Mr. Honest, let your child also go through the grooves of that honesty, mold of that honesty, character of that honesty, characteristic of that honesty, length and strength of that honesty. At least if the child is not following, he knows that you are not with that child. Don't give an overleaping cover. Tomorrow time shall not cover those children. That day to my surprise, I was parting with my one grandchild and I gave a hug. It took me three hours to get out of the smell. Skin smelled like alcohol. Clothes smelled. You know, once sometimes you go with beautiful clothes and go to some restaurant where the smoking is on, and when you come up, you take your clothes off, you look like you are stinking. That's how it was. We are very appreciative of the God and Guru that we have a very clean way of life. Cleanliness is godliness. It's my prayer that our emotions and commotion be all clean too. We need muscle of the spirit, muscle of the mind, and muscle of the body. We also need the dormant atma clean and awakened. We also need a clear mind. We also need good physical strength. There's nothing good and bad, thinking make it so. And thinking is the job of the mind. And Guru said, Soche Sochana Ovei, Je Soche Lakhwar. The split in you, the physical body, your work body, and your fantasy has never come to one unity. You are always three-faced people. Guru gave us a Kal Murat, Ajuni, Saivan, Gurpasad. Now you understand what a Kal Murat means? That's what it means. We have one face as Guru gave us. It's one word as Guru gave us. It's one life Guru gave us. It's one guidance Guru gave us. Not only we will live, that we should share in experience with our children. Let us not become only the parents. Let us thereafter become teachers. Gurudev Mata, Gurudev Pita. Let us, as parents, become their teachers. If you fail in the role of being a teacher to our children, we will never be successful to have good children who will have a great future and who will be grateful to you. You are just emotional, sick parents. You have to become sick teachers to your own born. So they can learn tomorrow. So there will be no sorrow in their life which you have faced. There's nothing wrong to tell your children life is not very pleasant most of the time. There's nothing wrong telling the children that you did something wrong. There's nothing wrong me telling you that I abused my body and my time and I worked 22 hours and went on and on stupidly and look how much suffering I have gone through. There's nothing wrong. There's nothing wrong in it. It's a fact. Yesterday I went to a state dinner and body gave up. And BBG told me I was snoring. I thought I was chanting. I do not know. I can make him move out of it, but the fact is, body said goodbye, Yogi Ji. 
I am not with you. And she pushed and pulled, you know, why? it's a matter of status. Whole state was there and His Holiness, Sri Singh Saab, Pai Saab, Rupajan Singh Yogi, and great biggie, you know, whatever you want to call it. And everybody coming, the Secretary of the State, ba ba ba. And here the man was, grrr, grrr, grrr. <coughs> because there was too many long hours. And I said to myself, sometime, sometime, it's good to stop. Then we came in at night, and we wanted to stop. Then a phone call came from somewhere, couldn't stop. Then we tried to stop, and then time came up. It was ambrosial hour. Finally, I stopped in my own stupidity. And there was nothing wrong in that confession. Because I realized when I was reading Japji, I was reading Japji, I was looking at the lines and they were mixing. Have you that idea? And then reading Japji, I was sometime nine, ten inches down. I thought I was kissing the, uh, my scriptural book. I realized I have dragged myself. I have drugged myself. And I am the same idiot Yogi Ji who doesn't stop. Well, yoga came handy. I went into the restroom, bathroom, did a posture, activated my nerves, put some cold water, came, read my bodies. I was nice. And after that, I knew I have to sleep. Alapahar, Sulupasi, Nindra, Deya, Chamatan, Preet. That's Guru says. Sleep and time to sleep. Rest when you have to rest. It's best. But don't over rest or under rest. Don't over act or under act. Nirmal. Nirmal karma kavaya. Nirmal means simple, soft, clean, clear, with understanding. If your acts are of understanding, then everybody's acts are understanding. Then you are understood. It's very f essential for parents to do that. Demonstrative teaching is the best teaching in the world. That's why you will see my personal staff and my near staff is always tired. You know, you might be talking about what happens. No, you know, it is very difficult to continue with 22 hours gala going. I call it gala going. And it is not right. So today, let our soul walk through the realms of consciousness. I'd like you to close your eyes. And this is what we did with the university yesterday. We'd like you to do the same. We'd like you to close your eyes. And we'd like you to take the optical nerve to control the frontal lobe to re-energize your inner cells of the neurons at 60 degrees and focus them at your chin. I want you to make you understand that you can totally take away your relapses and give you a beautiful strength. Once you do that, your eyes are fixed at 
the chain, the moon center, closed eyes, rolled inside, and you are calm and quiet and peaceful, tranquil. Now you have 26 vertebrae. Now, passionately, each vertebra try to rise, Vahe Guru, 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 all 26 vertebras are the ladder to the Akasha, to the Shashara, to the heavens in your kingdom of the body. From the tailbone to all the way, you have to go up saying, Vaheguru, Vaheguru, as you are going on the staircase, step by step by step by step. Tresha Guru Mantra. This Vaheguru Mantra is a mantra which Brahma, Creator, Vishnu, Sustainer, and Shiva, the Deliverer, chants. Vayanti Karanti Jagatpati Tvaha Brahma De Tesha Guru Tvahe Guru. We'll provide you the music from the stage and they will do back this meditation at home to experience, but you stick around and experience it and see you can ride the ladder to the Akasha. That's your Akasha, friends. Not the sky is your Akasha. That you can do an aeroplane. This you do in the little shuttle of your mind. By each vertebrae. Why Guru? Why Guru? In the way Why Guru is. Not the way Why Guru. Not American style or Indian style. Vahe Guru, Vahe Guru, Vahe Guru is completion. It must sound completion and accomplishment in the each chant. Vahe Guru, Vahe Guru, Vahe Guru. Step by step. Step by step. Loud and clear. So you can hear. You must hear your sound. My soul, travel with Vai Guru. From one rhythm to another rhythm. Each vertebra is a progression, is a step higher than the other. Is a ladder to lead onto the heavens, the Akasha.
whisper Oh my soul sound and resound rise and rise step up step over step until you reach the height of the akashic self the crown chakra same way as a unit the bindu doing the bandagi the prayer reach out to the entire universe all existence vibrates i vibrate we vibrate and god vibrates let us mix the vibration make the entanglement as one beat of the heart and beat of the god go through it रखे रखन हार आप भारियन गुरु की पैरी पाए का सवारियन हो आप दयाल मन न बसारियन सात जना के संग बहुजल तारियन कमर कमर वाई गुरु कर बड़ी बेटिंग फार है self talk No, 
नानक because you do not know to hear your own words you don't know what you're saying you do not know what you're talking about you are just like hired attorney of devil's workshop that's what you all are you take a plea and you want to make an impact doesn't matter what the reaction will be and how much destruction it can do you just keep on going 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 it doesn't work folks if you have no relationship with your atma with your soul you have no relationship with anybody if you cannot control your mind man jite jag jit if you cannot conquer your mind you cannot conquer the world it is now the age of aquarius don't die in vain don't be insane listen to the guru's shabad and listen clear loud yourself all bountiful prosperity happiness grace will come to you where god lives there's no shortage karta tere sab kuch hai jis de mein jo paave sada sirf sala teri naam man basave naam jin ke man basya vaje sab where the identity of the god is established the wisdom of the guru prevails there shall be nothing but richness birtha apne ji ki gur pe ardas kar pray to your own guru the state of your mind and control your mind mind was given to you to live not to plaster you and destroy you when ego catch up your mind you are done you are done deal so long yourself has your mind you are graceful 
I hope every day you will spare some time in the twilight zone and the ambrosial hour and the, in the evening to meditate on yourself. May we be blessed and may we be very graceful. Our birthday is coming, birthday of the Khalsa. It's just almost a month or some days away and we have to celebrate it with such a grace that you can certify and verify that we are alive in our values, in our commitment, in our character, in our characteristics, in our care, in our share, in our bliss, in our beauty, in our bounty, as sons and daughters of the father of the nation, Guru Gobind Singh, and mother, Mata Sahib Deva. We have a privilege to be born. And we have to walk the path as his children. We shall walk and smile at our face and with absolute dangling grace so the people know Saint Sarmarchi. If you march is not like a saint, you are a living devil. Life is a comparative study. There's nothing wrong to it. Take it either way you want it. And this life is a chance. At a glance it will go away. Be now and here. And hear me clear. Guided under the Guru's guidance. You will have no shortage of anything. It is his blessing which gives us a life of bliss. Why Guru Ji Ka Khalsa? children come on
you don't you want it i mean you want that all collection which has been denied to you so far you don't want to see it yes or no yes, sir. what i am asking special nothing same thing I shall donate three thousand dollars today on my account. And Sopurk will write the check, correct? Good. Anybody else? That was expected. Sopark also give him. She's pretty rich. Oh, look at that. That is a special amount. How much? How much you said? Huh? What? <laughs> Say it again. I give you a chance. How much you said? All right. <laughs> okay, that's fine. about um, while, while we were all still awake, because he wasn't the only one who was having trouble staying awake, uh, we were listening to James Baker, who was the secretary, former Secretary of State, and he told a, a, he told a story about Washington. And someone had asked me why we were building a lunger hall before, and I, I thought of the usual reasons. And he told this story. He said that Harry Truman used to say, if you want a friend in Washington, get a dog. So when he told that, I thought, that's why we're building a longer hall. We don't live like that. And we're, we have a project that is going to build a community, but it really has to, it has to happen as a community project. And it's important to me that It is important that your children should know that you participated. You participated for their future is a gift, is a legacy you leave for them. And it shall stay there forever. That's the way of living. So please understand, if you live in Washington and you need a friend, you have a dog. If you live in Espinola, you need a friend, you have God. <laughs> there are some pink pads of paper and pens uh, in the center of the floor. We'd, based on the way the project is working, um, we would like as much cash and, and checks today as possible. We'd also like pledges payable by the middle of June. So please uh, contribute what you can today, right here, right now. Um, and also fill out pledges payable by the middle of June, and we'll work with you on that. I would like to work with anyone who feels they can't participate in this because I know that we all can. And please talk to me about it, and I can work out the great, easy, fun payment plan. And we can all be participants, and everyone will be able to say that it's their Lunger Hall and our Lunger Hall. And that's the only thing that's going to make it work and get us to the next project, uh, for us all to have that feeling and that commitment to it. So please fill out the pledges. Raise your hand now and pledge more. Write a check. Give cash. You can give it to me. Put it in the box.
Mr. Simran? Five eleven. Soren Carr was a thousand and three. Yeah. City column was eleven hundred. You can write from Mahakalpa and Blundy eleven hundred dollars without us speaking. I'm culpusing on my authority. My checks to sh to Sikh Dharma Gurdwara project. The sequel, the Lunger Hall. It's not necessary that we have to give thousands. You can give even one dollar. That's not what we are asking. We are asking. We are asking you to participate. It's, it's a matter of participation. And if a guru wants to get this done, and a guru wants to give you money, it shall come to you. There's no reason for it. Please write it down and voluntarily give it to the Guru in that little pledge and leave it there. We'll send the collection company of Khalsa behind you. Also, there's work for everyone and it's, uh, I know I'm just grateful that we're stacking blocks and not piling mud into forms and beating it down with a jackhammer. Uh, so it, it's going to go much faster. Um, our uh, architects and construction people got smart, much smarter this time. Uh, it's fun work. It's much faster. It's like uh, Lego. <laughs> so participate while you can, because just stacking one block is going is to be a lifetime connection to the project. And you can even scratch your name and someone inside a heart if you want on that block. So uh, I'm just grateful to be part of the project and I'm going to keep pushing for the next one. So let's pay for this one fast. Wai Guru Ji Ka Khalsa, Wai Guru Ji Ki Fateh. Chang yaya 
Panacharat, Teg Teg Fateh, Birdi Ki Pech, Pant Ki Jeet, Sri Saab Ji Sahai, Khal Saab Ji Ka Bol Bale, Khal Saab Ji Saab, Pola Ji Sat Naam Sri Sikidan, Keshdan, Behetan, Vibekdan, Visadan, Prosadan, Dana Sirdan, Namdan, Sri Amrat Sarji de Darshanishnan, Chankya Chunda, Bunga, Jugujuk, Atal, Dharmaka, Jajakar, Kharsaji Sa, Ponaji, Satnam, Sri Satnam Sri Vahe Satnam Sri Vahe Sikha da manniwa mat uchi mat patara ka Hey Akhal Purk Vaheguru Hey Akhal Purk Apne Pant de Sada Sahayda Tar Jiyo Sri Nankana Saab Te Hor Gurdwariyan Gurdama De Jinna Ta Pant Nung Chhodiya Gya Hai Kuladar Shandidar, Te Seva Sama Dadan Khalsa Jinu Vaksho, Enumaniyo Kaiman Satguru, Mitaniyo Ketan Satguru, Niyotiyan Diyot Satguru, Nipatiyan Kipat Satguru, Niyasana Kiyasana Satguru, Guru Griva Nawaj, Satche Pitta Vahe Guru, Heya Kaal Pur. सच्चे पातशाह जीओ बहुत बहुत धन्यवाद सच्चे पातशाह जीओ सारे साथ संग त्वादे फेर आए सी सत सच्चे पातशाह जीओ बख्शिश दे और सच्चे पातशाह सुख शांति दे और सच्चे पातशाह आनंद दे और सच्चे पातशाह सारे साथ संग अमृत वेला उठेंगे त्वादे ना त्वादे बानी बोलेंगे सच्चे पातशाह श्री सिंह साहब आय साहब हरभजन सिंह खालसा योगी जी बाबा निहाल सिंह जी छंगी से बड़ी छंगी से देव सच्चे पातशाह लाज करना सच्चे पातशाह आत्मा दा एल्फ्रेड डेड्रिक्स सच्चे पातशाह बख्शीश देव सच्चे पातशाह प्रेम कौर खालसा जन्म दिन है सच्चे पातशाह आनंद देव सच्चे पातशाह आत्मा दा लुइस डेविस सच्ची सच्ची फरदा पिताजी आनंद देव सच्चे पातशाह गुरकीरन को और दा जन्मदिन है सच्चे पातशाह आनंद देव बीरसिंह को और बीरसिंह ते बीर को और उस ते दा ट्वेंटी फर्स्ट एनिवर्सरी आनंद देव सच्चे पातशाह हरी आरती सिंह खालसा तेरा जन्मदिन है ते सतनाम सिंह उसे ता जन्मदिन है सच्चे पातशाह सुख शांति दे उसे सच्चे पातशाह ते माइकल मेट्सकर उसे ता आत्मा जी नंद दे उसे सच्चे पातशाह बक्शीश दे उसे सच्चे पातशाह वांडा क्रिस्टी कैली मनीक टेलर सच्चे पातशाह लाज करना सच्चे पातशाह इतने गुरखा लंगर गुर प्रसाद तसी सच्चे पातशाह त्वादे प्रेम ना तदी दें के दिया उस सच्चे पातशाह अखरो डागा था बुर्चिक माफ करनी सर्व ते कार रास करने जी से प्यारे मेर जिन्ना मिले आम तेरा नाम चितावे गुरु नाने के नाम चार दी कला तेरी बानी सर्वत का वाहिब जी का खालसा वाहिब जी की पते आकिया बेअकाल की तभी चलायो पंत सब सिकन को गुरु मानियो ग्रंथ गुरु ग्रंथ जी मानियो परगत राम की दे जो प्रभ को मिल भोज है भोज शब्द मैंने राज करेगा खालसा की रहना कोई वार हुए सब
ਸਭ ਲੰਗੇ ਬਚ ਸਮਝੋ ਹੋਏ ਰਾਜ ਕਰੇਗਾ ਖਾਲਸਾ ਕੀ ਰਹਿਣਾ ਕੋਈ ਕੁਆਰ ਹੋਏ ਸਭ ਲੰਗੇ ਬਚ ਸਮਝੋ ਜੋ ਬੋਲੇ ਸਾਰਾਤ ਮਹਿਲਾ ਪੰਜਵਾਨ ਨਾਲ ਨਿਰਾਇਨ ਮੇਰੇ ਚਮਦੂਤ ਨ ਆਵੇ ਨੇਰੇ ਨਾਲ ਨਿਰਾਇਨ ਮੇਰੇ ਚਮਦੂਤ ਨ ਆਵੇ ਨੇਰੇ ਖੰਡ ਲਾਈ ਪ੍ਰਭ ਰਾਕੇ ਸਤਗੁਰ ਕੀ ਸਚ ਸਾਕੇ ਗੁਰ ਪੂਰੇ ਪੂਰੀ ਕੀਤੀ ਤੁਸ ਮਨ ਮਾਰ ਵਿਟਾਰੇ ਸਗਲੇ ਦਾਸ ਖੋ ਸੁਮਤ ਦੀਤੀ ਰਹਾਉ ਪ੍ਰਭ ਸਗਲੇ ਥਾਨ ਵਸਾਏ ਸੁਖ ਸ਼ੰਦ ਫਿਰ ਆਏ ਨਾਨਕ ਪ੍ਰਭ ਸਨਾਏ ਜਿਨ ਸਗਲੇ ਰੋਗ ਮਿਟਾਏ ਪ੍ਰਭ ਸਗਲੇ ਥਾਨ ਵਸਾਏ ਸੁਖ ਸ਼ੰਦ ਫਿਰ ਆਏ ਨਾਨਕ ਪ੍ਰਭ ਸਰਨਾਏ ਜਿਨ ਸਗਲੇ ਰੋਗ ਮਿਟਾਏ ਵਾਹਿਗੁਰੂ ਜੀ ਕਾ ਖਾਲਸਾ ਵਾਹਿਗੁਰੂ ਜੀ ਕੀ ਫਤਿਹ ਦਿਸ ਚੈਨਲ ਆਫ ਲਾਈਟ ਦਿ ਪ੍ਰਵੇਡਿੰਗ ਗਾਡ ਇਸ ਵਿਦ ਮੀ so the desk courier draws not near me hugging me to his bosom the lord preserves me true is the true guru's instruction the pervading god is with me so the desk courier draws not near me hugging me to his bosom the lord preserves me true is the true guru's instruction the perfect guru has done the perfect thing he has beaten and warded off all mine enemies and has given me his slave the sublime understanding pause the lord has caused all the places to prosper safe and sound i have returned home again nanak has entered the lord's sanctuary which has rid him of all the diseases safe and sound i have returned home again Nanak has entered the Lord's sanctuary which has rid him of all the diseases Waheguru ji ka khalsa Waheguru ji ki fateh Sab sikhana ko hamare Sab
Oh, I'll put the album on, no, no, I'm sorry, oh. 
Kalim. 